a game where Tredis could get the file that is just boom amazing man ow you came into my house the house of madness <laughs> What up brothers and sisters and welcome to MTG Malone with me, Matches Malone. Thank you all so very much for tuning in. I hope you're having the most wonderful freaking day. The giveaway is still going on. There is a link right here. At least there should be, you know? <laughs> Usually there is. We never missed it. So yeah, also I hope you like my totally not 3XL shirt with swords to plowshare on it. I don't know what happened, but I like it. I still want to wear it, you know, but it is so huge. Like, you could put a whole freaking other Malone in here, you know? That is just <laughs> very, very crazy. Today we're playing such a beautiful deck. But before we get into the deck, please, subscribe to the channel. We're on our way to 20 freaking 6,000. We're not even 300 people away. And, uh, you know, there is a chance that we can do it this month. So, if you haven't done so, please consider subscribing. You would help me out a lot and I would be looking very darn cool hitting the 26k so soon. I would love it very darn freaking much. But enough with the yammering. Let's get into the trading captivity trap. 13 cards I win hammering. <laughs> this card. I don't know why. The name is so hard to say, man. But look, it's Triska EDK file. Somebody out there thought it was a good idea to call it that. And uh, yeah, here we are. This card is absolutely amazing. Uh, you have no maximum hand size, which is super good. At the beginning of your upkeep, if you have exactly 13 cards in hand, you win the game. So this is before draws. Remember that. If you have 12 cards in hand, it looks before draws. So you need 13 cards in hand before you draw your last, uh, before you go into your upkeep. And yeah, she's always willing to lend a hand and that is what she does today. The game is, the deck is absolute bananas. I don't know what came over me when I built it, but it's absolute freaking bananas. Because we're playing all of this with training grounds. Activated abilities of creatures you control cost two last to activate, uh, but it cannot be less than one mana. So, what are we doing? A lot of stuff. We're playing a card that you have never played before in standard, the Hypnotic Grifter. For three mana, uh, you can connive, so you draw and discard something, but Training Grounds makes it one mana. Absolutely bonkers. We're playing the Search Engine. Now this costs only blue, and later on, you know, this here will reduce the last ability to four mana instead of six mana, which is also absolutely amazing. So, also, this only works if the card is blue and only once. So, why do I say this? Because we're playing a Gata Soul Cauldron. You exile your own search engine, put a counter on your Triska, on your Hypnotic Grifter, your Reality Chip, your Sheldred, whatever. And now you can always, you know, well, not on a Sheldred, but you can use it here because this is blue, this is blue, this is blue. So the search engine, draw three cards, will work wonders. Why am I playing Sheldred? Because I'm drawing so many cards that against mono blue, uh, mono red, this is our only way to survive and we will survive so good. We will have so much life that there's nothing they can freaking do about it. Liliana is also super good because us discarding something doesn't matter because we can just use the soul cauldron, put a counter onto a creature and now it has the abilities of the other creature. So we can steal this ability which will cost us only two. We can use, uh, we can steal this ability, which will only cost us a little bit. And you know, this also makes your Sheldred freaking unblockable. So that is also very darn freaking nice. So if we can only activate this if it doesn't have Defender. And if we do this before we use the other one, we can actually turn Sheldred into a blue creature and uh, use the third ability as well. Reality Chip. This card breaks this deck. It is so good. This little equipment jellyfish, for whatever reason it needs to be a jellyfish, just be... I don't know. Just let's not talk about it. <laughs> you may look at the top card of your library anytime. If you have your draining grounds out, you reconfigure this for one single mana. And now you are able to use your top card. You can play lands from the top of your library and cast spells from the top of your library. So that means that never... Play a land from your hand ever again, which works super well with the Triska Decay file. 
Did I say it right? I think I did. Uh, because now all the cards that you would usually play, you just keep in your hand and use the card on top of your library. And there might be stuff like Cut Down, Go for the Throat, Shattered Scenic, but also Make Disappear, you know? All of these are very needed. Like, you cannot go only blue with this deck. And Liliana as well, just, you know, sacrifice one of their creatures. Very darn freaking tasty. If they go super wide, Shattered is your only hope to survival. But, you know, with all the removal that we have, usually they should be able to. And we also have an Ottawara, so we have Legendary Creature here, Legendary Creature here. So, uh, this will only cost us freaking two mana, which is absolutely great. Takenuma also mills us cards. We return something that we want, and we maybe don't want to exile with the Agatha Soul Cauldron. And, you know, with all of these stupid five-color combo decks that are out there right now, you know, with the Desecrator... You can just exile something from theirs before they can, you know, use their whatever Bramble Familiar side of the deck. It's just... I love the deck playing it, but playing against it is absolutely miserable. Also, these new lands. Can we please appreciate it? I spent all of my gold, all of it, to get these lands. So yeah, I'm also running four Dismal Backwaters, because usually turn one doesn't interest us too much, you know? And uh, if we have a black source and we have a cut down, maybe we play our black source instead. But gaining the four life here is absolutely crucial. Is there anything I forgot? I don't think so. Just remember that the deck is absolute freaking madness. I won way too many games with it. So yeah, I had a lot of freaking fun. I hope you will enjoy. This is 13 cards I win. <laughs> Matches Malone, and I will see you in those reality chipped games. Some people say that 13 is the unluckiest number, but I said, hey, it is a very, oh my lord, there you go, Crimmers. Absolutely, I told you it's a lucky number. I told you. Okay, and I like the hand, you know, I really do. Here's our search engine now. And then we will have Liliana. Oh my, okay, alright, I like this. Here we go! Alright, so we will see what they do here. But right now we're looking pretty darn tasty, don't we? Anaxantry. Well, you go ahead and do that, my friend. You go ahead and do that. I couldn't even care less about it. Oh, I cannot play Liliana. All right. Well, that is still fine. Still kind of fine. Putting it on my Triscadote file. I, I don't know how to say the word. But we can do this over and over again because we have cut downs, go for the throats. So, yeah. And there's Liliana now. So I guess they have a Wandering Emperor in hand. Let us just chill here. Because I don't want to run into a Wandering Emperor. Rebel Rousing. Okay, alright. Fine with me. I would just be doing nothing here, you know? Just destroying the creatures. And then one day I will have 13 cards in hand. <laughs> it's just easy peasy, you know? <laughs> so with the diet now, we're nine away. That's in the turn. What are you doing, my friend? Crawling chorus, okay. It's Kraft's Hive, also alright with me. I will just draw a card then. Hmm, this costs six, right? I mean, this cannot be blocked, so that is pretty good. Um... Those who get in my way tend to regret it. Let's do this. Haven't you ever heard of personal space? And then we just cut down here, I guess. 
Training grounds would be amazing right now. But it doesn't look like it. And not a rabble rousing. Well, you get out of here. Doesn't look like we would get another... Uh, at the training grounds here right now. But we are also looking pretty good, you know? Is there any creature in here? No, but... I do have this, so getting rid of the grifter. Oh my lord, <laughs> I almost missed it. They did have a wandering emperor. Cannot believe it, they did have it. Okay, and here we are. Nine damage to the face, you cannot block, boom! The luckiest number ever, man. We didn't have the training grounds and we still did them dirty. Oh, get out of here. That was a nice game. We're up against a sneaky prawn. I like that thing a lot. Also, do you like my totally not 3XL shirt that I got? Like, I was in Vegas and it was like, uh, yeah, I would like the shirts in uh, L and they gave me a 3XL. A 3XL, man. That was just terrible. Terrible, I tell you. So, we do have to make this appear here. Oh, they're missing lands. Okay, all right. So, we're not doing anything. I want to keep my make disappear. They found a land. Okay, all right. Okay, all right. So how am I doing this? I'm not doing anything here. I'm waiting until I have, like, you know, my training rounds or something. I would just counter whatever they do. That ain't gonna happen. Wait. Resolve? I would just destroy that sucker. Like, there's literally no reason not to do it. Okay, here's the reality chip now. I'm passing the turn. And still counter something they do, you know? And still do that. Maybe we even find our training grounds. Who knows? Sneaky prawn! Why to shake down heavy mom spaghetti? I don't understand. And in case you're wondering what that even means, it's an Eminem reference. <laughs> Eight mile. <laughs> <laughs> Just so you know. Just so you know. Okay, what are you doing here, my friend? Graver Trespasser. Okay, I can still destroy that. But if they have, like, a cut down or whatever, you know, that would be very darn saddening. Getting rid of one make disappear. And figure here. Training grounds is online now. I'm just slamming in there. Training grounds is online now. Shadred is annoying. my whole shtick is to draw cards, you know? Alright. Let's draw one here. Let's do this now. Get a soul cauldron. And pass in the turn. We do still have answers, you know? We just need to freaking find them. We have a lot of answers, actually. Like our own Sheldred. At least they're using a good art style. Okay. If only I would have kept the stuff. Only I would have kept my stuff. Please no land on top. Another search engine. That is actually alright. A land. Another land. Okay. 
Bringing down blockers now. Doing this. And passing the turn. I do have counter spells now, so hey yo, you know? We're okay. Because they will be doing something expensive. I can smell it from here. Yup, just as I thought. Just as I freaking thought. Something expensive. So we can block with the Triska the K file, you know? That is already very darn good. And with everything else as well, so yeah. Um, Blocking here like this. Losing the search engine is not even the worst thing to happen here. What? <laughs> <laughs> okay, alright. <laughs> you do that, my friend. You freaking do that. Okay, another blocker coming down. There's a land now. Another reality chip. Keeping this one. Another training grounds. And passing the turn. Otawara is super nice here. Because we can return the Shadra to their hand. And then slam in for a lot of freaking damage. Or draw some freaking cards also, you know? Because right now we can't. We just freaking can't. Are you still slamming in? You are, the mad lad. Okay, alright. That is fine with me. I can live with that. You know, putting something like this on my search engine is not even the worst thing that could happen. Okay. All right. I mean, they brought this on themselves, you know. <laughs> brought this on themselves. So I'm just hoping here. I'm just freaking hoping here. If they do have another one in hand, a hey, so be it. You know, nothing I can do about it. Is there now? Okay. Get rid of their shadow here. Put a counter onto you. My turn. Draw, yes. Okay. Alright. So here's a land. Another land, but we can finally do this. And start drawing some cards, you know. Let's draw three cards here. Not a reality chip. Another search engine. They're countering it. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Whatever will I do? Okay. All right. Well, that's saddening. Ending the turn. Six, eh? Freaking six, eh? Okay. I mean, hey, we uh, are through half of our deck and we haven't found too much removal yet. We also have like a Liliana, you know? So it should be coming down. Or our own Sheldred. That would also be very good because it would just, you know, destroy their Sheldred. Okay. Now what have you got in here? Are you playing your virtue now? That would be funny if you did. Let's connive here. And get rid of the reality chip. Um, getting rid of you here. Draw. Freaking finally, man. Freaking finally. Okay, alright. That is super darn good. 
Because we have another one on top. Man! I was digging for you like crazy, man. Like freaking crazy. Okay. You're countering that now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, decline. Is this a perfect time to do this? Enough with the mystery. Enough with the yammering. So, I am attacking in. Ending the turn, discarding you here. Man, what a long freaking sequence of the things that needed to happen here to make this happen. Ottawara. Well, let's still draw here. We're still fine, you know? Left the freaking reality chip. This should cost us like one blue right now. Okay. Can we please find like the thread disk fee file creature? Can we? Oh well the Shadrid is also alright. Shadrid is also fine. Drop it. So they can always play the whale, you know? And they're just slamming it down like there was no tomorrow. Okay, alright. But that is kind of all you're doing here, my friend. That is kind of all you're freaking doing here, my friend. Did you find a cut down? I would just make this appear it, you know? Man! <laughs> they scoop! <laughs> <laughs> what was this game, man? But the full power of the freaking cauldron came down, man. Oh, it was beautiful. It was freaking beautiful. But you know, having one more of Triska E the K file would have been very darn freaking nice. I want to win like that. I really freaking do. Get out of here. That was such a nice freaking game, man. We're up against this lemon. All right, I like the hand a lot. Really do. Okay, so is this mono red going for... I knew it. I just felt it. I don't know why I just felt that this was mono red going first. It's just, you know, clear as freaking day sometimes. Clear as freaking day sometimes. Monastery Swift Spare. Nothing else, though. <gasps> okay, all right. Okay, all right. You know, a cut down would have been super beautiful here, but this also works for me. Okay, alright. So one more land and we're good is what you're telling me, eh? One more land and we're freaking good. Makes sense. Getting rid of you here. There's the one more land I was hoping for. I mean, hey, I'm not even mad, you know? If Mono Red keeps a freaking one lander just because they have three Monastery Swift Spares in hand, it's not my fault. Absolutely. Great. I'm taking it. I'm freaking taking it. Lightning Strike, okay. All right. That is, you should have maybe attacked in first, you know? <laughs> Maybe I should have done that. But I don't know. I'm no expert. Uh, yeah, getting rid of you here. Bringing down the chipster now. And not attacking in yet. So. I mean, hey, things are looking okay. You know, not gonna lie about it. So what you got now? A lightning strike to the face. Okay, alright. Just go ahead and do that. I'm still gaining life every single turn, so, man, I'm not even sad for Mono Red here, you know? I'm not even freaking sad for Mono Red here. They absolutely deserve everything. Um, I'm still chilling here. And... 
Another lightning strike to the face, okay. <gasps> yes! Oh yes, that is so good! That is so extraordinarily good! Okay. Are you coming down? You're coming down. And now I can draw two cards is what you're saying? Beautiful. Freaking beautiful. Okay. Alright. Like there is nothing in my graveyard now, right? No, there ain't. So, yeah. I'm just drawing two cards here. Going back to what? 11? Yeah, that is good. That is pretty good. Not gonna lie about it. Play with fire to the face. Okay. I mean, at least they're still trying, you know. <laughs> at least they're still freaking trying, man. I must applaud that. That they're still freaking trying here, man. That is just great, isn't it? That is just great. Okay. So. I mean, that is the whole reason we have Shadrid in here, you know? Just to draw all the cards, gain all the life. I will not even be doing anything here. I will just be chilling. The one, two, three, four, five, yeah. I will not be doing anything here. I want to win with the Trisk and the K-File at least once. Oh, I said it right. I did say it right. All of that doesn't concern me too much, you know? Not even ever so slightly. Okay, how many cards do we have in hand now? Oh, this is so good. This means that this only costs one. What is our hand size? Eight. Perfect. I can make this appear something. I can just make this appear something. Whatever you do here, my friend, whatever you do, ain't gonna happen. How many cards in hand? Nine? Oh, it costs a blue. Okay. My turn. How many cards in hand? Nine? All right. Let's play one more just to be safe. Just to be freaking safe. Oh, I cannot believe it that we win like this. I cannot believe it. I hope they're letting it happen. I really hope they do. No blocks? Okay. All right. It is beginning of upkeep. It's before my draw. I draw three more cards. And then I just win the game. Oh, we're winning a game with Trennis Day File. That is just boom, amazing, man. Ow, oh, you came into my house, the house of madness, man. I will crush you in my hands. One land, are you mad? No matter what deck you're playing, you should never keep one land. Get out of here. We're up against Hashimoto Takazi. I don't know. It feels like I would... I don't know. That, that there should be H's in there, you know? Hello! Hello! Are you also mono red? You're not. I like that. I like that you're not mono red. Hello, friendly waver of the hand. Hello! Okay, I don't know what you are, though. Oh, no! My soul cauldron! I hate you. I hate you with a passion. Uh, let's bring down the reality chip. The rest. Who even plays the rest anymore? The Phyrex and Flash George. Okay, all right. I do have answers for that. Here's the answers. Nobody knows Dominaria shadows like me. Sacrifice that creature. Nice, thanks. I will even give you the fish slap. <laughs> Let's give him a um, slappity slap here. Okay, all right. And I can discard a land here. Don't if they want to destroy my Liliana so bad, go ahead. She did what she had to do. Three mana removal. All I have to say. Oh, another Flash, George. Okay, all right. And a Scrap, George. Okay. So, but you can never attack in. 
Never freaking ever. Um... So here's the grifter now. Go for the throat on the armored scrap, George. Making it so that they have to attack in. And then we're good. No one will be outsmarting me. No one. Okay. So if you really, really want that, you know, you can go all in and do it, my friend. You can go all in and do it. Totally freaking worth it. So, training grounds, please. No training grounds. Okay, all right, but we can attach this here now. Do this. Lay a land. Beautiful. Another reality chip. I mean, you know, we, we, we are winning here right now. They need a lot of things happening right now to be very, very good. Okay, all right. I mean, you know, they're making themselves a food token, so that is already good for them. The Kanuma! Okay, but you cannot play it. Oh, no! Best deck in the meta! What is happening? What are you doing, best deck in the meta? One, two, three, four, five, six. If they do draw land here, they can, you know, play the stuff. But if they don't, we're good. Okay, land. Training grounds, please. Soul Cauldron. That is nice. I like it. Uh, let's connive here. Get rid of the reality chip. Pass the turn. I'm just hoping that they draw land. That is honestly... Why did I not attack in, by the way? I am... There is no need to attack in. There just ain't no need to attack in. Because they scoop anyways, you know? <laughs> there was literally no need to attack in because they knew. They knew the game was over, man. Oh, what a dirty deck this is. I love it. Get out of here. We're one away from getting into the slightly bigger rank, so you know what will happen now. The most annoying game ever. It already starts <laughs> with our opponents going first. But we do have two training grounds, which is also very good. So I will keep this hand, actually. Mono red? I mean, look at them. If that isn't mono red, I don't know what is. Black land, please? Thank you so much, game. I love you. Oh, game, I just love you dearly. Monastery Swift's Burial. Oh no, did you just lose your creature? Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm very sorry, not. Alright, here's the Hypnotic Grifter. And another cut down for you, my friend. Just another cut down. And then we could start conniving, maybe. Question mark. No, we can't. Okay. Cannot start conniving. But we're still at 19 here. Hey, what is even going on here? All right, training grounds. And training grounds. And then next turn we have the Shadrid. And if we draw a cauldron. Oh, sweetest baby Jesus. Okay. Well, here's Shadrid for your troubles. Oh, Shadrid, baby. You really have an answer in hand? No? Okay, I like that. Like, you could deal me three here. I don't mind. Squee. Are you squeeing in, though? You are. The mad lad. Okay. If that is worth it, you do that, my friend. You freaking do it. Search engine is super darn good here. Super darn freaking good here. No attacks. I will be drawing a bajillion cards very soon. Very darn soon. So. What are you doing, my friend? Charming scoundrel. Okay. Making a treasure. So this gives plus two plus one. I have to. 
Or did I have to? I don't even think I had to. I don't even think I had to do it. But we will see now what happens. <gasps> Liliana, eh? This still only cost me one. Beautiful. Freaking beautiful. <laughs> Freaking beautiful, man. <laughs> oh, Mon Red, you thought you could crush me, man. You really thought you could crush me. But I will tell you one thing. Think again. Because I will be coming out from the underground where you don't expect it. You think you can attack me through the sky? You think so? Oh, let me tell you what. If you try to get me in the sky, I will come from the underground. And rip you down, and I will make you suffer in your own grave. I love beating Mono Red. Oh no, oh no, oh yeah, Crimmers, yes. <laughs> I said, oh no, oh no, oh yeah. I feel like the freaking uh, Kool Aid Man. All right, depending on what they do here. Okay, that is fine. Ooh, um. Let's bring down the training grounds. If we draw one more land, we have Sheldred, which is super good, as you have seen before. Passing the turn. You think they have a Brotherhood end or something like that? What are you, Brew? What are you, Brew? Just brewing around. I see, I see. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. I hope it was worth it, my friend. I hope it was. I'm just playing another one. Do you have another one? Do you have it? Do you freaking have it? I mean, they spent three mana to get rid of it. You know that is very, very cool. I like that. So they're a uh, freaking attract, uh, not attracts, uh, a um, uh, the, the, the Itali deck. That is what they are. Just a freaking Itali deck. Okay, alrighty. Bring the chip onto you here, because now we do have the land on top, which is nice. Slamming in. They do have the Atali here, I can just shout it, dude. So, yeah, th it's not the worst thing that can happen. Not the worst thing. Well, that is pretty strong. That is indeed pretty darn strong. Ooh. I would still like to go with the Sheldred here. So, now they have 12 plus 6 is uh, 18, 17 mana available. 17 mana available. Okay, 20 mana available. <laughs> they used one land. <laughs> one land. <laughs> this is so good. The Virtual Strength is such a stupid card, man. Okay, that is a party, my friend. <laughs> that is a party, my friends, if I've ever seen one. If I've ever seen a party, this is it, man. This is it. Okay, all right, and they scoop <laughs> I loved it, man! I loved it! Three Virtue of Strengths with nothing in their hand to play it! So, I just want to show you. Produces three times, that means a land is three. Times three is nine. Times three is twenty-seven. Every single land here tapped for a twenty-seven. They had five, eight times twenty-seven. I'm doing it! I'm doing it! 8 times 27 is 216. They had 216 mana. Just like that. <laughs> Get out of here, man. <laughs> We're up against Sleepy Gary. Why is there so many sleepy people in the arena right now? I don't understand. So, 
There's literally no reason to, uh... Oh, I wish I had a freaking counter spell, though. I really wish, because they are the five color deck. Oh, they're not. They're not the five color deck. Okay, all right. I can live with that. Uh, let's slam in, see what they're doing. They have a cut down, so yeah, that's a little bit annoying. So we have to choose our battles here, you know? We really have to choose our freaking battles. Oh. I just skipped my whole turn. <laughs> just skipped it all. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, I mean, there was no reason to do anything anyways. You know, there was literally no reason to do anything anyways. So I'm just attacking in. Sometimes doing... I, I don't know, my hand just clicked, you know? It just clicked around thinking this was a good thing to do. But it wasn't. But it just wasn't. So training grounds would be absolutely great here. But we will see what they're cutting down. The Triska Kadei file. Triska Kadei... I cannot say it. It's just there is no way that I can ever say this card name. Oh, March of the Otherworldly Light. So they would have even had an answer to my freaking training grounds. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't that freaking beautiful? Okay, all right. We're slapping in there. Cut down it is. Horn locked whale. All right, yeah, that is fine with me. I don't need you. And now let's slam down these two. They don't have cut down. They don't have cut down. I repeat, they don't have cut down. But they're playing green as well. Lay down arms. All right. And... I mean, you know, there is a limit to what a man can do. There is just a limit to what a man can do. And uh, they also have like a um, freaking, uh, you know... Well, would they have done all of this if they had... Come on, man! Come on! Really? Freaking really, man? Removal tribal, my friends. I mean, where, where were you right now? Where have you been? I was waiting for you, man. You know, this is this my deck from yesterday? It sure as heck feels like it. Sure as heck freaking feels like it. Okay, so. Do you have another Leyline Binding here, my friend? Do you have it? Broke his charm. Okay, draw your two cards. It's not my deck. It is not my deck. That ain't gonna happen. That ain't gonna happen. You're drawing so many cards, I hate it so much. <laughs> I really do. <laughs> and they have nothing but removal. Nothing but removal, man. It is just exclusively removal, man. Exclusively. Look. March, lay down arms, uh, ley line bindings, horn locked whale. Well, it's not a real removal, but you know what I mean. They have another ley line binding in hand. Okay, all right. Do you, do you have another ley line binding in hand? Do you now? We'll have to find out, won't we? Another horn locked whale, man. Another horn locked whale, man. Is it a horned loch whale? Okay, I get it now. <laughs> I don't know why I always said it wrong. <laughs> but I did! Okay. Wandering Emperor, that is fine with me. Now you've done it. That's coming off. The thing is, they had so much power in the early game. So much! That they could just remove everything I owned, and now they're just chilling, you know? Now they're just freaking chilling. Disgusting. Freaking disgusting. I bet they have another Wandering Emperor. I bet they do. Reality chip is great. Just freaking great. Maybe there's a training grounds on the top. It's a land. That is fine with me. I mean, you know. In the first 23 cards, three Leyline Bindings. Three of them. Three freaking Leyline Bindings. This game is over. Bravo, game. Bravo. I know I won a lot, but this was just unnecessary brutality. 
unnecessary roughness. Flag. The game had no reason to destroy me like it did in that last freaking game, man. But, you know, maybe it had a good reason. And maybe that reason was just that I won six games in a row before, you know. The deck is absolute freaking madness, man. When I built it, I wanted to build it around Triska EDK file so much. I really wanted to. And that is why I thought, how am I pulling it off? Then I saw the training grounds, I was like, yes. That is it, man. A God Assault Cauldron, even freaking better. So yeah, if you're into funky freaking decks, this is it, my friends. This is it. With this, you know, you just go ham, draw all of your cards and win the game. What else do you even want? I draw, they lose in freaking deed, man. A huge shout out to all of my patrons and members. I really appreciate every single one of you. Of course, my sponsor, Ultimate Guard, that makes it possible that I keep the lights on here at MTG. I head on here at MTG Malone's. And a huge shout out to all of you watching as well. If you are still watching right now, please put a little Triska in a K file down below in the comments. And don't you look, write it the way you think it's written. Please, don't you look up the card name. Just write it the way you think it's written. I would love to see all these shenanigans in Women Series. <laughs> so yeah, uh, also a little update. Uh, my changing the studio will take at least at least one more week. So uh, this month, I think we will still be in the old setup. Maybe until the end of the month it will be done, but I have to do so much for it. And uh, you know, I still have like a normal life that I have to live. So yeah, we will see about that. So thank you also very freaking much for tuning in. And please remember, and if you're waking up tomorrow morning, my bestest friends of all, and you look into that mirror, and you see a beautiful, beautiful face of yours, and all of you are pretty freaking sweet. I'm Mattress Malone, and I will see you all tomorrow.